And the masters of the universe. I am Adam, Prince of Eternia and defender of the secrets of Castle Grayskull. This is Cringer, my fearless friend. Fabulous secret powers were revealed to me the day I held aloft my magic sword and said, By the power of Grayskull! became the mighty battle cat and I became He-Man, the most powerful man in the universe. Only three others share this secret. Our friends, the Sorceress, Men at Arms, and Orko. Together we defend Castle Grayskull from the evil forces of Skeletor. Me get this straight. This side is supposed to produce flowers. Yes, but man at arms, it. Orko, if you want me to fix your magic pyramid, just answer me. This side makes flowers. <laughs> Mud. Well, that's what I was trying to tell you. It was not working right. <laughs> and this side is supposed to produce a swan. Yes, but it's also. Orko. <laughs> and this side makes fruit, huh? Oh, no. You open it. I thought you said it was broken. Well, that's the side that still works. <laughs> well, at least some of your tricks work. Well, back in the land of Trolla, all my tricks worked. You hardly ever talk about Trolla. Where is it? In a different astral zone from here. It's a beautiful land. I'll bet you get homesick. Yeah, back home, I was a powerful sorcerer. I had respect. <laughs> you a powerful sorcerer? That's a good one. It's true. They called me Orko the Great. Well, if I were Orko the Great, I would stop playing with those meteorites. Because they might be dangerous. What happened? Those rocks from space seem to have a magical effect on Orko's pyramid. It's back! Why, it's a girl Orko. Where am I? The Royal Palace on Planet Eternia. I am Orko, Royal Magician in Residence, at your complete and total service. Huh? Boy, is he laying it on thick. Get the feeling he likes her? Orko? Not Orko the Great. You've heard of me? Everyone in Trawa knows of Orko the Great. You're a famous sorcerer. <coughs> I don't believe it. You've come from Trawa? Yes, I am Dree L. I was hiding from Dragoon when this box appeared beside me. I went to look inside, and it brought me here. Somehow the meteorites have energized it into a shuttle between Orko's world and ours. Who is this dragoon you are hiding from? An evil monster. All of Trala is in danger. Oh, Orko, if only we had someone like you to help us. Come on! Orko, what are you doing? I'm going back with 3L. They need me. Wait, Orko, let us help you. Yes, it sounds dangerous. You wouldn't fit in the pyramid. Besides, I want to do this myself. He's gone. I'm worried about him. So am I, but I don't know what we can do. I do. Trolla, just as I remember it. Shh, Dracoon will hear us. Let him hear. You're here with Orko the Great. Now, tell me about him. He's half man, half dragon. He breathes fire. 
Huh? It doesn't by any chance look like that. <laughs> hope of following Orko is the sorceress. By the power of Grey Skull. Not again. Skull, I command the job bridge open. Demon. This is only a temporary portal to Trala, and as you can see, it is much too small. Sorceress, do you have the power to make me small enough to enter the portal? Yes, but it is too dangerous. This portal will vanish at moonrise. If you're not back by then, you will be trapped in Trala. I'll take that chance. Orko may need help. Very well. Take this. It is the sphere of size. Squeeze it to grow small. Release it to return to full size. Good. We can enter the portal now. Remember, you must be back here by moonrise. Got it. Come on. Strange. Going through the portal changed us back to Adam and Cringer. Look at this place. Wow, upside down trees. Fish that fly like birds. Even the rainbows upside down. Things seem to be backwards here. <laughs> Look out! By the power of Grey Skull! It doesn't work here. Use your fire ray. What? Oh, something's wrong with this thing. Well, well, this calls for drastic measures. Help! Help! Maybe I can use those trees. It worked! Cringer, come on! The sooner we find Orko and get back to Eternia, the better. <laughs> At last, a voice of reason. Did we lose track of? Uh, 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 look! I don't see him. I don't remember Dragoon. Where did he come from? They say he was sent here by a creature called Skeletor. Skeletor? I might have known. You will not escape me this time. That's coming from the gorge. It's Orko. He's in trouble. Over this way. I've got a nice surprise waiting for you two at my fortress. They're trapped in a ring of fire. Help! We've got to do something. Help! Let me go! My fire ray! Oh, help! Help! It shoots water here. Orko, up here! Adam, where are I... you? Look out! Gotcha! Orko, your powers really are strong here. 
Very well, Tron. I'll return for you later. He's got Triel! What happened? Why aren't you He-Man? That's a long story. Let's go after Driel, and I'll tell you on the way. And let's be quick about it. We only have a few hours left. <laughs> Await their fate. Arco the Great will cut you down to size. <sighs> Such spirit, pretty one. <sighs> I will put your energy to good use. What are you doing to my people? You're about to find out. <laughs> you can't change into He-Man here? No. There's something about Trolla. Something I'm overlooking. I can't put my finger on it. You're sure it's not dark in Eternia yet? Yes, we still have two hours. There! Dragoon's Fortress! Let's find a way inside. What's wrong with them? What have you done? <sighs> I'm draining their energy from them. I'm so tired. <sighs> Sleep, Trollen. The energy is stored there. In the mega core. When I have collected the energy of all your people, my mission will be complete. The energy will be transferred to my master, Skeletor. Another one done. Now it's your turn. No! Stop! You can't do this! I see you have strong energy. You won't get away with her. Uh, I can't think. Can't think. Farewell, pretty one. I must not go to sleep. Come on, inside. <laughs> I better keep watch out here. Cringer. All right, all right. At least there's nothing guarding this place. Oh, I've had about enough of this world. Crazy beasts, upside down trees, fire rays that shoot water, even Orko's magic works. Everything's backwards here. That's it. Things are backwards here. If I say, by the power of Grayskull, backwards, maybe then it will work. Grayskull, overpower the mind! Take care of Dragoon. You look for Driel. Come out and play with me, frog face. Orko, go! No one defies me. Driel, where are you? Driel, what has he done to you? has that kind of strength. Skeletor warned me about you. Imagine his pleasure when he learns that I have banished you to the 
bottomless hole of trauma. This hole never ends. You will fall forever. It's time for your fall, Blue Man. A fall forever. Stand by, Battle Cat. Battle Cat, find another vine. Now comes the hard part. Understand? You risk your life to save me. I wouldn't have done that for you. That's how we're different. I believe in saving lives, even your enemies. I may be your enemy, but you're not mine. <gasps> Maybe I've been wrong. Maybe saving lives is better. You've got some heavy thinking to do. I hope you come to the right conclusion. But if I hear you've returned to your evil ways, I'll be back. E-Man. Thank you. Uh, Orko, what's wrong? It's Triel. I can't wake her up. Have you tried your magic? It didn't work. You can't give up. You are the greatest sorcerer in all of Trolla. Ah, that's right. We believe in you. But you have to believe in yourself. Keep trying. No matter what. <laughs> oh, with all my heart, from way down deep, Triel, please rise from Dragoon's sleep. Left. He had to revive all the other Trollans, and I think he wanted to show Driel his face. Huh? It's a custom among the Trollans. You only show your face to someone you love. Kind of like, well, it's like getting engaged. Ah, give me a break. Orko, you did it. You saved us all. <laughs> I'd better be going. Can't you stay here with us? Oh, I wish I could, but my friends in Eternia need me. There's still so much evil to fight there. I understand. Driel, do you think before I leave we could really see each other? Uh, show faces? Oh, Orko, I was hoping you'd ask. is starting right now. We'll never make it in time. We've got to. The moon has risen. It's too late. The portal's disappearing. I'm afraid they... Look! Well, I guess this means we've been eating our vegetables. Welcome back, E-Man. Good to see you, lad. What happened? Orko's magic saved his people. Really? 
You should have seen him. I could never have done it without your faith in me. Orko, why didn't you stay with 3L? You seemed so fond of each other. I wanted to, but you're my friend too. And as long as Skeletor threatens Eternia, I'm going to help you defend it. Well, little guy, I'm glad you're back. We need you. And by the way, you're one fine magician, and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Not even me. <laughs> In today's story, Orko is faced with a very difficult decision. You know, when we're young, most of our decisions are made for us, but as we get older, well, we want to make more and more of them for ourselves, and that's the way it ought to be. But sometimes we have a real tough one, a real problem, and when that happens, it's a good idea to talk it over with someone else, someone who really cares about you, like your mother or father, or maybe your best friend. Talking a problem out with someone else can be a great help. <laughs>